Hey everyone, welcome back to our Discord bot with Python series. Uh, we're using Discord.py as usual. In part 1, we set up our bot, we made it work. As you can see here is the script from part 1. It's pretty neat. In this episode, we'll implement a welcomer bot or a welcomer function. We'll, the bot will automatically greet new members with personalized messages. You can actually personalize the message and I'll show you how. You can run a command and it will change how the message will be shown. It will be well designed, everything will be good. Make sure you have followed the part 1 and you have everything needed to follow with us uh, in this uh, episode. First of all, we need to create a new event. We're just bot event async dev. Now this event is called uh, on member join, this is default event. On member join and we will pass in the member that I just joined as a parameter for the function. Now we'll create a new variable, I'm gonna call it greeting, and it will basically be the welcome, let's just spell it all, welcome message. So we need to create a welcome message really quick, let's just put it right here, welcome message. You can put it in APIs too, it doesn't matter, or a config or whatever you want. So we'll just create a welcome message, welcome to our server, and member the mention something like we're glad you're here now as you can see here we have a member dot mention we need to format this so it will replace the member that we have in the message we need to format our variable and say that member equals member you can change this to whatever you want but member needs to equal member for it to work after that we'll just simply member dot and greeting which is our message or you can just put this here it doesn't really matter we need to specify a new variable which will be the welcome channel id really quick we're gonna get our channel id here you go to the channel right click and copy channel id and we just paste the channel id right there now we have to uh, send the message that channel ID, that specific channel that we have here. Create a new variable, let's just make it simpler and just create a variable first thing we need. We'll call it the welcome underscore channel. But we don't need to get our channel, so we can use later on dot channel the, the, and the ID of our welcome channel. Take this uh, uh, welcome channel and we do welcome dot send greeting. No, you have two choices. Either you make if you keep it member dot send and it will send the message in the person's DMs, or you will do this for example the welcome channel it will send it to an exact channel. Both works, so uh, we have like now two ways how to send this greeting. Now let's uh, really quick start our bot to test it out, and the bot is online. So let's get someone to leave and join again. Here we go. Welcome to our server. Pull it around HyperGDD and we are glad you are here. Now we're gonna do the other part of the script where we are gonna to make it change the welcome message and we are able to change the welcome channel ID. First of all, let's create um user. Uh what we'll do here if if user will just like this and just copy this really quick. Member dot send else. So what I did here, if user, if we set it as user, it will send the message to the person's DMs, else it will send it to this specific channel. So we'll just keep it to the specific channel right now, but we're just making our bot have multiple functionalities of how the message will be sent. Keep in mind, these, uh, these doesn't get saved, like these variables doesn't get saved. If you restart the bot, they will be gone. So really quick, let's make it, for example, welcome, welcome send user uh, dm this will be a better uh, function to use but you can use whatever function i uh, mean variable you want it doesn't really matter so now let's go back to creating our command so let's make a new command that will be able to change our welcome message or etc etc so set welcome message let's call it pass in the context and we'll take in the message as a so what we'll do here we'll get this welcome message variable we call it as a global variable so we can edit it and we're gonna welcome message equals message so we're taking this welcome message that we'll be using here etc 
and we'll change it to a new message will be this the message that we input as set holding now we'll just do something simple like this ctx oops ctx send custom welcome message has been set and we'll just pass in our let's add an f string here or we'll just do this message that works and now we'll just show us our message to that we have that we have set let's go do something else um let's make a change it's, it's the same deal but now let's make it change the channel id we just replace both of these that's it really and we can change the uh we need to change the what command to say welcome channel and here we'll input or we'll pass in the channel uh id as an integer since it's a number and we'll just send set welcome channel welcome channel id has been set to start it again and let's see if it works or not okay let's get someone to join really quick that way we can we can use it here we go welcome to our server Hold it around you're glad you're here so we'll just do our command which set welcome message and the message we want will be like something like welcome and member welcome again now we're gonna mention the member mention glad you are here member dot name so the this should work okay something i forgot about here i did a little mistake so we'll just use an f string not big of a deal go here we'll add this here f string got the easiest so we'll just use it same deal here like this and we're good now let's test it out again the same command just copy and paste there we go <laughs> the custom welcome message has been set to that message so let's leave and join again and we'll test it out again here we go welcome hyper gdd welcome again oh i misspelled it fully down hyper gdd glad you are here hyper gdd so as you can see it works perfectly now let's go to uh changing the channel id that it sends to uh plus it custom channel id and let's choose another channel let's go to general support channel id and copy the general support welcome has been set to that all we have to do now is join again and as you can see it sent it to this channel i didn't send it to any other channel but it sent it to this channel as you can see it works perfectly now we set up our welcomer to change our message change the uh, channel id so i'll leave it as a homework for you to figure out how to make it send the user dm Use this variable to see if you're gonna send it to the user uh, as a DM or you're gonna send it to the uh, channel ID. How we set up the auto set welcome message, set welcome channel, etc. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give us give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content. In the next part of the series, we'll explore more exciting features of our bot, including interactive command and more. So make sure to hit the notification bell so you won't miss it. Happy coding and see you in the next video.